The Burlington area Chamber of Commerce is in the fray of Burlington's economic recovery. Well, the Chamber has brought back its networking PM series, and it's actually great to be back out in person with people and hear the struggles that some people are having, but also be able to just get business going and, and start having those relationships back. With businesses getting in stride, there's been a changing of the guard at the BACC. So I've been with the Chamber for about eight years now. I started when I needed to build my network eight years ago when I was in business development and selling property casualty insurance. And I've been a member ever since. And just recently they asked me to become the chairperson of the Chamber and I was very happy to accept. Kelly brings some, some new ideas, but it's uh, we've got a great uh, staff at the executive level of the Chamber. They're helping her along, they're helping us along. We're looking at what the new chamber is going to look like and we're seeing how we're going to move this organization forward and we're really looking forward to a breath of fresh air. We have a huge vision. Coming out of COVID, the first thing that we want to do is really let people know that we're back. And when I say back, it's, it's hashtag BACC. We are back. We work to help with the challenges that businesses can't accomplish on their own. The BACC is working constantly behind the scenes. And I don't think that people always know that. For example, the recent MWRA grant that we got, the chamber had a lot to do with that. Several of the companies paid for a consultant to come in and write the actual grant language. We worked very closely with the town. At the end, uh, we ended up, I don't remember the number off the top of my head, but it was a couple of million of dollars in a grant. And what was going to take 10 years to accomplish the MWRA tie-in has now been significantly reduced. So we're always here. We're working behind the scenes to help the community. So whenever we talk about shop local, dine local, bank local, stay local, please do your best to, to keep it in Burlington and in the Burlington area. I'm a Burlington resident and I have been for 25 years. I recognize that the companies here in Burlington pay a third of my property taxes, a third of my taxes, and I am eternally grateful to them. And so we try to work on that that partnership with the resident and the, and the companies, and I think we're doing a really great job. From Tuscan Kitchen in the district, I'm B News reporter Tad Stefanak.